Bros, I'm pleased to announce I am selling my Gamer Girl chair. Um, it's it's in peak condition, as you can see. Uh, pristine, uh, right out of the box. It's great. If you want it, it's perfect, and it's customizable too. See, it's black now, but you can make it white if you really, really, really want it. See, just put a little effort into it, a little, a little love, a little customization. How how can you do this to a chair? What what kind of ass does this lady have? Is she a Twitch streamer because her ass twitches? There there is no way people say cats. Unless she has a cougar in her house, I do not believe that this is possible. Honestly, I am curious. If you take this VTuber and you place her on top of a Russian tank, given enough time, will the Russian army suffer attrition? Will they lose a tank? Because I am a little bit concerned. Yeah, I, I'm just trying to, to figure out w what type of ass belonging to a human being can do such a thing. To a chair. Apparently, the chair is uh, a couple of years old, but but still, you're supposed to change it after a while. I mean, this particular type of coloration shouldn't happen. Apparently, she is asking five thousand dollars for it. I think that uh, she should ask for more, because a self-respecting simp would definitely pay more for it, and uh, we know that everything is worth what. Its purchaser would pay for, and uh, five thousand dollars is a bargain. You know, uh, she may just sell the cushion. Doesn't even have to sell the chair. This is not what bothers me. What bothers me is like, how do you get it to look like that? Like, what what is required? Uh, someone said that maybe she's a goth girl and she's got like those stockings. Like, are, are you insane? Like, if you put stockings versus chair, chair wins hands down. But this is not what. Has happened there. No one transpired. Short Fat Otaku says that uh, when I was at my fattest, I did this to a chair in about eight months. Jesus. Now, I would also like to point out that gaming chairs are a scam. Yes, that's true. Uh, do not buy gaming chairs. Trust me on this one. You see, America is a country that uh, perfected corporatism. And the corporations do want employees to be effective. They, they want to work as much as possible. Uh, as such, they created the office chair. Now, the office chair may not look great, uh, but it is very comfortable. It's designed so that when you sit your ass down on that chair, you don't feel the need to get up. So I do recommend people to buy office chairs. Uh, they, they are also good for the back, but more importantly, they're actually durable. Uh, gaming chairs, I, I had many experiences with them. They look nice, I suppose, if you're a streamer and you want people to see that you're sitting in comfort. But either than that, they're very expensive. They break really easily. Heaven forbid you have a cat. So, no, the best thing are office chairs. And, and for some reason, I do not know why. They're actually better than managerial chairs. Right? And managerial chairs, they're comfortable and all that. But they also break really easily. Meanwhile, an office chair, I got mine for two years now. And I'm not uh, a very thin individual, right? I do not talk with a petite voice while on camera. But it, it still holds up. Like, there, there's nothing wrong with it. So, yeah. My recommendation, buy office chairs. Do, do not... Not buy these atrocities. Um, although I, I would have to see um, nanobytes as Tushi in order to understand uh, if the chair was a problem or um, maybe maybe it's just like her body type requires something stronger, something more durable, like the Iron Throne from Game of Thrones. If she becomes the queen of the Seven Kingdoms, do you think that she would wear out the Iron Throne or not? Tell me in the comment section and I'll see what you guys have posted.